welcome back to my channel today uh, we're gonna be testing out some new brushes and I'm so excited about that uh, the brushes we're gonna be testing are the Moto Mythical by Royal and Lane Nickel brushes this, is this set right here this, this set comes with uh, five brushes and a pouch it says these are excellent for wet and dry products so they're really versatile these are cruelty free and they're a hundred percent vegan it says uh this six piece moda kit is what your unicorn dreams are made of functional brushes with a with a unique style we've selected five brushes to complete endless looks and have included a cool holographic pouch perfect for travel or at home on your vanity so first of all let's talk about the packaging it's really nice it has the holographic all around the box as you can see it's really nice it show it showcases the brushes real nice too you can see all the brushes that come in the pack um, and then in the back you'll see the description of the of the brushes all the brushes and their names and what they are for uh, it says it comes with a blush brush uh, it says uh, a complexion brush a dome shadow brush a crease brush and an angle liner brush so and also it comes at the bottom you can see all the social medias where you can find them at if you want to follow them they're in the back of the box so it's really nice um, so yeah let's open this I got these brushes a couple of days ago and I've been dying to use them. So yeah, okay. Okay, so when you when you get them out the package, this is what you get. This is the pouch, the zip pouch that you will get. It's so pretty. So so pretty. It has it says Mora right here. It has a little white zipper. So this is what it looks like. This is so pretty. So beautiful. And then you get your brushes. So let me get them out. So you get five brushes. You get your blush brush, which is this one right here. You also get your complexion brush this one you get your dome shadow brush you also get a crease brush which is this one right here and your angle liner brush this one right here so right at the back they don't feel cheap at all this is what the brushes look like they're beautiful, beautiful, beautiful brushes. They don't feel cheap. They feel a little heavy. Not too heavy, but not too light either. Like, they feel really good. Um, so, all the brushes have their names. So, that's really good because I know there's a lot of brushes out there that, that don't have names. And sometimes that's annoying. But... I mean, for a drugstore brush, these are beautiful. Okay. So right here in the front, you will find the Royal and Lane Nickel uh, logo. And in the back of the brush, it has the name. It says Blush Brush. So you will know what brush you're grabbing. Um, I love the design of the brush. It's really nice. It's like a cone, uh, cone shape. And it looks like a unicorn horn. So, so pretty. Oh, I love the color. I love the packaging. It's a metal packaging. It's rosy with gold at the end. So it's really nice. Uh, it feels really, really soft. Really, really soft. So, yeah. The other brush is the same. They all have the logo in front and the name, the back of, I mean, the name of the brushes in the back. So that's real nice. 
they a really good size they're not too short and not too long so they'll be really easy to maneuver so yeah let's get started so today I'm gonna start with my eyebrows and the brow pencil I'm gonna be using is this brow stylist definer by L'Oreal and this one right here I'm in the color dark brunette I've been using this uh, brow pencil for follow I mean a few days now and I love it gotta say I'm really happy with it so so now let's go over my eyebrows with the Anastasia the brow pomade it's this one right here this is in the shade medium brown I'm gonna be using the angle eyeliner brush to do that this one right here let's see how this one is if it's good to apply the brow product I don't know how I feel about doing my eyebrows with this brush because it's too small I feel like it's too small for that but so far so good okay so now I'm gonna clean this brush a little bit because I'm gonna apply concealer to clean up my eyebrows I usually use another brush but since we're testing these brushes I'm and this is all I'm gonna use I'm gonna do this so to clean up my eyebrows I'm gonna be using the Maybelline super stay better skin concealer this one right here this is in the shade light to medium and I'm also going to use this as a primer. Let's see. I'm going to use my finger. So now, let's color correct our face. And the color correcting stick I'm gonna be using is this e.l.f. color correcting stick. I'm gonna apply this on my under eye. And a little bit right here. Okay, so now let's apply some foundation. The foundation I'm gonna be using is the CoverGirl Healthy Bioless Healthy Elixir Foundation. Is this one right here? This is in the shade 732. I know I've been using this um, foundation in a couple of my other videos, and that's because I'm in love with this foundation, and I really, really recommend it. So yeah, always shake your foundations before applying. And to buff this in, I'm going to be using the complexion brush. It's this one right here. They are really, really soft. I don't see any streak marks so that's good another thing I like it it's that it's it's small so you can go over your eyebrows without worrying that you're gonna mess them up with the foundation because it's small enough 
to go over them without messing them up so far i'm loving the brushes so now i'm gonna apply some concealer under my eyes to bright them out my the center of my nose my cupid's bow and my chin I'm gonna blend this in with my sponge. Now to set my concealer, I'm gonna be using the Derma Blend Loose Setting Powder. I'm just gonna apply a little bit of these. This is in translucent, by the way, if you wanna know. I do not bake, I just press it in. Okay, so now let's start with the eyes. And the palette I'm gonna be using is the Swamp Queen palette by Tarte. Is this one right here. The color I'm gonna be using as a transition is the Natural Peaches, is this one right here. And I'm gonna be using the the crisp brush to apply that color. So far, I gotta say, I love them. Um, did I say that already? Well, if I haven't, I love them. They blend, I mean, this brush blends the eyeshadow so nicely it's so so nice so now i'm gonna go in with dogman this one right here i'm going with dogman apply this color on my crease top off the excess This color too is so pigmented. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with these uh, dome shadow brush. This one right here, and I'm gonna go in with uh, sassy bun. I'm going with sassy bun and SFS. This one right here. And I'm gonna be applying this color in the inner and center part of my eyelid. This brush is a little bit big to do this, but since I don't have another one and this is the only one that comes in with, it's fine. I'm gonna make it work. Okay, so now let's apply some eyeliner. And the eyeliner I'm gonna be using is the Maybelline Master Kajal. Is this one right here? This is in the shade Onyx Rush. And this is a cream coat eyeliner. This one right here. It's waterproof. So I really, really like that. Now let's apply some lashes. And the lashes I'm gonna be using are the Kiss Lash Couture. Fox Mint Collection. This lash is right here. I do not know how to pronounce the name. I think it's Bador, Boy Door. I don't know, but this right here. And I'm gonna be applying these lashes off camera, so I'll be right back. Okay, so now let's apply some mascara. And the mascara I'm gonna be using is the Maybelline The Colossal Big Shot Volume Express Mascara. This is in collaboration with Shayla this one right here it's so pretty i love 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 the packaging of this mascara it's so nice so i'm gonna apply some of these on my lower and top lashes and i'll 
going back to the angle eyeliner brush, I'm going to be applying some shadow on my lower lash. The shadow I'm going to be using is the Natural Peaches and Dogman. Okay, so now let's come to our face and the brush I'm going to be using to do that is the complexion brush the same brush that I used earlier to apply my foundation I'm gonna be using this to contour and I'm gonna be using sweet tea the contour shade the bronzy shade that's on the palette I'm using this brush like this because in the packaging it says that you can use either dry or wet products so and i wanted to see if that was true and i have to say it is it's blending out my contour really nicely And this brush is perfect to apply your contour on the hollows of your cheeks because it's not too small and not too big so it fits right in there and that's really good so you will have more um, control of where you put your bronzer or your contour using this brush because it will go exactly where you want it to go and to contour my nose, I'm going to go in with the Dome Shadow Brush. Okay, so now let's apply some blush. I'm going to be using this beautiful brush right here. This is the blush brush. And I'm going to go in with the blush that's in the palette, which is... Uh, does this thing really work? this one right here and now to highlight I'm gonna go in with the crease brush I'm gonna use the also the highlighter that's on the palette and is this one right here gator wings So on, on my brow bone. So for lips, I'm gonna be using the Forever Matte. Is this one right here? This is by RK, by Kiss, and this one is in the shade Tiki Toe. So now let's set the face and I'm going to go in with my Makeup Revolution Pro Fix setting spray. Okay, so guys, this is my final look. This is what this is what I was able to create with these five brushes right here. These brushes are amazing. I'm in love with them. They are really good. Uh, this blush brush is awesome also as you can see you're able to use them with dry and, uh, and wet products which is I use this brush for my foundation which is a liquid foundation and also I use it for my contour and that's powder so that's really good all I did I would clean it with a wipey and I used it again 
then the crease brush i use it to apply the transition shade and my uh crease color and i will also use this to um highlight my face also the dome shadow brush i use it to apply the color of my lid and i also use this to contour my nose and this brush is really good for that and the and the angle liner brush i use it to uh put the cream product on my eyebrows and i also use it for applying um eyeshadow on my lower lash but i gotta say this for the eyebrows is not good but i know it will be really good to apply eyeliner so this brush right here but other than that i love the brushes they're really nice they're gorgeous they're really really pretty and uh they're really good really soft really good quality i didn't notice any shedding no hairs fell off so i gotta see uh once i wash them gotta see if uh they lose any hairs or anything but i don't think so because they they look I mean they look like they're really uh they're packed really good so yeah so yeah guys this is it if you like my video please don't forget to give me a thumbs up also hit that notification bell so when i upload a video you'll be notified also don't forget to subscribe if you haven't please do that i would love to have you in my youtube family so yeah have a nice day love y'all bye